Uh, good morning, Master. Yes, I, I know you don't like mornings, but I say that it's good to help brighten your spirits. You don't want to get up. I understand, but there are a few things you have to do today. What? Uh, I don't... Uh, no, I'm not one of the things you have to do. I don't really know what you're talking about, Master, but you don't have to worry about me. It's my job to look after you, not the other way around. Anyway, I made you some tea to help you wake up, just the way you like it. Help you sit up? Is something wrong? Are you hurt? I, I wouldn't want to accidentally hurt you more by touching you. Uh, should I call for a doctor? No? Take your hand? Oh no, I shouldn't. My hands aren't very soft. You probably wouldn't want to touch them. Oh, good. You can sit up. Really? Is something wrong, Master? You look irritated. If it's something I did, I fully apologize. I would never dream of trying to inconvenience you. Uh, well, if you're sure it's all right, here's your tea. I'm so glad you like it. I do my best to make sure it's perfect every day. Oh, it's nice and warm? Good. Hmm? Uh, no, uh, I don't know. What else do you think would be warm? Do you want me to make you something? Uh, well, yes, I suppose my skin would be warm, but people do tend to be warm, Master. Are you sure you're feeling all right? I should check your forehead for a fever? Uh, but I'm not qualified to diagnose you. I couldn't possibly judge your health like that. Oh, I really should call for a doctor. No? Uh, then what should I do? Please, tell me, Master. I'm getting worried about you. Read you today's to-do list? Of course. Uh, first thing for today is form approvals. There aren't too many to deal with, I think. Hmm? Uh, uh, yes, I can help you with that. But I'm afraid I don't know much of the process. I'm just a simple maid, after all. You'll hold my hand through it? Well, uh, of course. I'll try to learn as fast as I can so you don't have to babysit me. And after that, there's a meeting in the afternoon. What? Uh, you'd rather meet with me? Uh, I can certainly bring you a snack afterwards if you like. I know you always get hungry a bit early. Uh, after that, well, you said you wanted to inspect the renovations in the kitchen and see if they were up to your standards. Huh? You'd rather inspect me? Um, uh, I can certainly assist you with it. I may not know much of construction, but I'll gladly help you with whatever you like. You... Like me? Oh, uh, I'm glad. I like you too, Master. Now, what else? Oh yes, there's one more thing. You were invited to a party tonight. Hmm? Uh, it doesn't appear to be celebrating anything, just a get-together, I suppose. I can prepare an appropriate outfit for you. Oh? You want me to let them know you can't attend? Of course, it's no problem. But... I'm still worried about you, Master. Are you certain you're feeling all right? It's not like you to back out of an engagement. You've made other plans. Oh, with who? Uh, should I make up the guest bedroom? W what? Y you have plans with me? Oh goodness, did I forget about my performance review? I'm so sorry, Master. No? Uh, then what is it? You just want to spend time with me? But why would you want to do that? No, no, of course I'm not opposed. But I don't understand. I'm just a lowly maid. Why would you ever want to spend time with me? Come closer. Is it a secret? Ah! Master, what are you doing? You want to cuddle with me? Well, yes, I do want to, but I hardly deserve such treatment from you. I'm not at your high standing. Well, yes, whatever you say goes, Master. 
It does feel nice. And I suppose it couldn't hurt to start the day a little late. And tonight? Yes, I'll be ready for you. Whatever you want, Master. Is that a fucking woodpecker? Oh my god. The entire fucking animal kingdom is conspiring to stop me from reading the script. <laughs>